Hi, my name is Przemek Hojecki and this episode is about a question Do you need to do a PhD in order to become a data scientist? Or should you do a PhD in order to become a data scientist? The short answer is no, you don't need any degree actually to become a data scientist or a computer scientist, a software engineer Actually, you don't need any degree to do anything in life most of the time because if you want to become a, a doctor then probably you need a degree but in general in computer science in software you don't need any degree uh, to become successful uh, think mark zuckerberg and facebook of course uh, but on the other hand uh, phd can greatly boost uh, your career uh, for example the example is uh, the, the brain uh, and sergey brain and larry page uh, founders of, of Google, uh, which were in the process of doing PhD at Stanford uh, around the idea of uh, search. Uh, so that really helped them build the company and they had the initial IP built within uh, already their PhD. So the answer really varies depending on what you want to do in the end and whether you want to, for example, go to work at the startup, whether you want to find your own company and build your own startup, whether you want to be a freelance data scientist or do you want to work at a large organization, there are plenty of opportunities and depending on where you want to go next uh, or and what kind of role you want to fulfill, uh, the answer will vary. So as a rule of thumb, if you want to go more into research oriented positions which are heavy on machine learning, deep learning, uh, there's a lot of uh, reading papers, then probably having a PhD will be a good idea and not for the PhD itself. So if we take a step, a step back then, my understanding of education is like that. So it doesn't really matter what kind of degree in what, uh, what subject you're doing, what you're learning along the way is this. Bachelor degree is basically meaning that uh, you're able to interact with uh, uh, your teachers, you are able to uh, interact with other students, complete some basic fundamental uh, projects uh, on your own, so you are able to work in like um, a corporation. Then if you go to master degree, then basically having a master says that you are able to understand literature, uh, you have uh, this focus on a, on a domain, you are able to uh, perhaps understand what's going on with research, but you don't have any impact yourself on, on the on a given domain. And then if you go to PhD, then actually doing a PhD and completing PhD means that you're able to do research by yourself, you know the research literature on one particular subject, and you're able to invent something new, prove something new, uh, create some new algorithms which are better and than the, the previous ones and somehow improve the domain you're entering. So, so that's a general truth about the education uh, if you think about it. So having said that, it doesn't really matter if you do a PhD, for example, in computer science, mathematics, physics, biology, chemistry, uh, it all gives you the same mindset of being able to do your own research and apply this mindset to any given role at a company. So especially currently with this changing role of education, as we all work remotely, we all learn remotely, uh, this will become more important. So it doesn't matter anymore what kind of education you're getting, but rather how deep you're going to that education, whether you're doing research by yourself, uh, can you do a project by yourself? Can you do research by yourself? Uh, do you interact with your other with other students, with teachers? Do you ask questions? This is all part of the mindset of doing research, uh, of being a good researcher, and then in the end becoming a good coworker, becoming a good researcher in a team, building your team, um, and so on. So you should answer really those questions. How much do you want to do research in your industry, in, in your role? H how do you view yourself as a data scientist? Do you view yourself more on the software side where you uh, just engineer different mechanism and maybe read the data? Or do you view yourself more on the machine learning roles where you have um, a lot of thinking about algorithms, particular parameters, how to tune them, uh, what is uh, what is missing, what kind of architecture you want to use, uh, and all that stuff. So it really depends on you and there's no good answer. So don't worry about the degree, 
uh, more worry more about the practical side of coding and what you want to do in the end uh, because that's the most important especially right now uh, as we're living in this remote world it's really important to uh, be able to convey that uh, you know what you're doing you're able to finish your projects uh, on time um, and you you really give good feedback to your other co-workers uh, so so that that is what is important so good luck with your career in data science if you want to uh, have more educational materials like that please subscribe to my channel give me a like and see my other materials on this youtube channel thank you for watching